Hello and welcome to Wonder of Learning Channel. In this lesson, we will be learning phonemic awareness, phonics, handwriting, high frequency words, and oral vocabulary words for Wonder Kindergarten, Unit 3, Week 3. Phonemic awareness. We will use I say, you say, we say practice for each part. Count and segment syllables. I will say a word, you will say it back to me, then we will say the word together, then we will segment the word into syllables and say how many syllables we hear. Example, I say insect, you say insect, we say insect, insect, how many syllables? Two. I say center, you say, we say center. Center. How many syllables? Two. I say simple. You say. We say simple. Simple. How many syllables? Two. I say pillow. You say. We say pillow. Pill o. How many syllables? Two. I say dentist. You say. We say dentist, dentist. How many syllables? Two. I say finish. You say. We say finish, fin ish. How many syllables? Two. Phoneme isolation. I will say a word. You will repeat the word. Then we will say the word together and isolate the beginning initial sound. Example, I say one, you say one, we say one. What sound? Wha. I say sink, you say, we say sink. What sound? I say yellow, you say, we say yellow. What sound? Yeah. I say white, you say, we say white, what sound, wuh. I say green, you say, we say green, what sound, g. I say violet, you say, we say violet, what sound, v. Identify phoneme blending. When we read words, we say the sounds and blend them together. I will say three sounds. You will say the three sounds back. Then we will say the three sounds together. Then we will blend them into a word. Example, I say, but it. You say, but it. We say, but it. What word? Bet. I say, whatever. You say, we say, web. What word? Web. I say, n oat. You say, we say, n oat. What word? Note. I say, g um. Mm. You say, we say, g um. Mm. What word? Gum. I say, t app. You say, we say, t-ap. What word? Tap. I say, l-i-v. You say, we say, l-i-v. What word? Live. I say, s-e-d. You say, we say, s-e-d. What word? Seed. Identify phoneme segmentation. When we spell words, we listen for each sound. We segment and separate words into sounds we hear. I will say a word, you will repeat the word, and then we will say the word together and segment the word into sounds. Then we will count the number of sounds we hear. Example, I say knob. You say knob. We say knob. n a b how many sounds? Three. I say bet. You say. 
We say bet. B it. How many sounds? Three. I say wise. You say. We say wise. W I z. How many sounds? Three. I say same. You say. We say same. S a m. How many sounds? Three. I say rip. You say. We say rip. R ip. How many sounds? Three. I say face. You say. We say face. Ace. How many sounds? Three. I say home. You say. We say home. Um. Mm. How many sounds? Three. Phonics. This week our phonics letter is C. C says. What sound did you hear? Yes, the correct sound is k. Let's look at words that start with C. K. Cab. We sound it out as k. Ab. C says k. Cake. We sound it out as k. Ake. C says k. Camp. We sound it out as k. A. M. P. Camp. C says k. Hat. We sound it out as k at. C says k. Clock. We sound it out as k u a k. C says k. Coat. We sound it out as k oat. Coat. C says k. Cold. We sound it out as k o u d. Cold. C says k. Corn. We sound it out as k or n. Corn. C says k. Cow. We sound it out as k ow. Cow. C says k. Crab. We sound it out as k or ab. Crab. C says k. Handwriting practice. This week we will be practicing writing the letter C. Let's first look at how to write an uppercase C. Look at the diagram shown. Follow the steps to write an uppercase C. Now let's look at how to write a lowercase C. Look at the diagram shown and follow the steps to write a lowercase C. These are examples of uppercase C's written. Now you practice writing uppercase C's. These are examples of lowercase c's written. Now you practice writing lowercase c's.
Now we will look at this week's high frequency word. What are high frequency words? They are the most common words that readers see and identify when reading. This week's high frequency word is go. We will look at using this week's high frequency word in context through high frequency word sentence builders. Get ready to read each line with me. He, he will, he will go, he will go to, he will go to the, he will go to the store, he will go to the store quickly. Our complete sentence is, he will go to the store quickly. Notice this sentence starts with a capital letter and ends with a period because it is a complete thought that makes sense. Lastly, we will look at the oral vocabulary words that you will hear in this week's reading story. The first word is local. Local means having to do with a particular place such as a neighborhood or town. The second word is neighborhood. Neighborhood means an area in a city, town, or other place that is different from other areas in the same way. The third word is routine. Routine means a regular course of action. The fourth word is intelligent. Intelligent means having a great ability to learn, think, and understand. The fifth word is volunteer. Volunteer means a person who offers to work or help without pay. We are finished with the lesson for today. We will visit the lesson again tomorrow. Great job on all your hard work today. Thank you for learning with us today. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. We hope you'll join us again soon for another lesson on Wonder of Learning. Until then, bye-bye.